Voluntary evacuation order was made for coastal and low-lying areas of Taylor County today. ABC 27's Gabriela Mercurio is in Taylor County. So Gabriela, what are officials saying led to this decision? Well, there is potential for two to four feet of flooding and storm surge areas like here in Keaton Beach in Taylor County. And although it is a little windy, besides that, it's been a pretty nice day here overall. I've even seen a handful of people come out and enjoy the beach before the rain. But county officials are telling me that high winds, storm surge and possible flash floods are their main concerns. Although the evacuation orders are only voluntary right now, Director of Emergency Management John Lauk urges people to stay informed and listen to any updates. He says if the storm is bad enough, they won't be able to help people who didn't evacuate right away. And we just want to make sure that folks know that until the, the winds do go below 40 miles an hour, that first responders won't be able to respond to them. Laug says in preparation for possible tropical storm force winds coming in, they'll be opening one shelter in Perry at 8 a.m. on Wednesday. Taylor County schools will also be closed Wednesday through Friday.